you by feeling? How's everybody feeling? Yeah, I feel like that too. It's time for celebration, yes? I don't really know because there's a beautiful storm brewing outside. And I'm comforted, you know, in the wind and the rain and the clouds because I know our ancestors were here. You know what I mean? When the clouds come in and your ancestors come in, those clouds, you know? And that's a comforting thing. You know, and I learned a lot about this place. He's going to sing from the east. Here that we've gathered at tonight. Some interesting histories happened in this place that we've gathered here tonight. A lot of, a lot of ancient colonialism has happened in this place. But I think it's beautiful because you know, the last 12 years, this place has been a place of beautiful music and healing and vibration. And, which I think is a testament to the power of music. When we gather in these places and we'll share our stories. So thank you. How about that Dustin Thomas, huh? <laughs> Little Buffalo. A testament to the animal kingdom. An angel in our midst. So thanks for gathering with us here. This is our first time, really, I would say, headlining our own show here in Kentucky. So thank you all for being here. Pretty cool, you know, pretty cool that we could have this many folks come to see us play in this part of the country. Which really goes to show that social media and word of mouth has a lot to do with how this music is getting out there, you know. So thank you for sharing this with your friends and your family. It means a lot to us because this is all we do. This is what we live for, you know. It's
So we've traveled from far and wide to be here today to crush you. We are the seventh generation. Declaration. And forgive our egos as we learn to walk in the good and humble ways. May we learn to be accountable for our actions and respect this gift of life. In this year of the horse, we paint the song of generations who sang before us. We pray in the shape of Da Vinci's perfect men and broadcast love letters from our third eye to the first and second mother to our everlasting father. So we hook lines to the real God's fishing pole. May we become fearless captains. Fearless captains. <laughs> As my Saturn began to return in orbit, my giants woke from their place slumber and whispered new stories of an age where air signs and water bears must bear the water song and give resonance to how connected we really are. So come, let us circle around that great fire. Connected by song lines and call upon the rainbow city to guide us to the center of it all. The cedars are really ringing, you know. And it's the sweetest sound I've heard since my mother first said, I love you. This is easy. 